Okay, happy to see you here on my channel Brain Logic, and let's go and figure out this super simple math problem right here. And what we have is 50 plus 50 divided by 2. Seems pretty basic, seems pretty easy. Everyone learned this stuff in the in the third grade. We have very simple addition, very simple, very simple division. However, many people are going to get this problem incorrect. So if you could do this without a calculators, put your option down into the comment section. We have three options: A, B, and C. So choose one option. What do you think is a correct? And write your option down into the comment section. I'll show you the correct answer here in just one minute and then I'm going to kind of really emphasize an extremely important basic math concept that is going to be the reason why a lot of you are going to do this incorrectly. So here is our challenge, here is our option and right now let's try to solve it. There are two types of people. So one part of people solve this question like that. So here is our challenge, I just wanted to rewrite it. So we have 50 plus 50 divided by 2. So here is our challenge and one part of students solve this question like that. They say, okay, we have addition, we have division, so let's go from left to right, let's go, let's solve this question whatever we want, we, we have this addition 50 plus 50 equal to 100 and with this division by 2 we have we have 50, yeah, so it looks like 100 divided by 2 equal to equal to 50. So one part of students solve this question like that, we have this option A, and this is really interesting moment. Because obviously whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. This is very interesting and important thing in our case. Right here we don't know about order of operation, we just do whatever we want, we add it first, then divide. This is very interesting and important moment, because in math, we should know what is the correct order to do this problem, what is the correct rule, correct property, so we can't solve one question with two answers, which is really bad and really important thing I want you to understand. And right now we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. So let's solve this question right now according to a correct order of operation, okay? Because right here we solve this question randomly and right now let's solve this question according to a correct order of operation. For example, let's look at this PMDMC order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. All internet libraries, scientific graphing calculator works according to PMDMC. But I want to say one really important moment, doesn't matter what order of operation you select, PMDMC, maybe Bodmas, we will have absolutely the same answer, because in this case, doesn't matter what order of operation we select. So let's look closely at this PMDMC. So first evaluate parentheses, then evaluate exponent, then evaluate addition, uh, division and uh, multiplication group, and then addition and subtraction group. This is a very interesting moment. So parentheses have the highest priority, which is really important. Parentheses the highest priority, then the lowest priority, addition and subtraction. So this is a really important moment. So right now, let's write this question once more. And right now, let's solve this question according to this order of operation, which is absolutely correct in terms of mass. Okay, so we will check with this 50, maybe 50. 50 is the correct answer, I don't know exactly, but let's do this. So 50 plus 50, we have division by 2. Okay, let's scan what we have. We have parentheses, parentheses have the highest priority, so let's scan where do we have these parentheses. Let's look at it. For me personally, I don't see any parentheses, yeah, I don't see it, and let's skip this part, okay? We don't have any parentheses, so we just skip this part, which is really great for us. Okay, exponent, what about maybe squares, cubes right here? No, I don't see any of those, we don't have any exponents, so we just go to the we just go to the next step. Okay, we don't have exponents, we just go to the next step. Okay, multiplication and division group. This is one common group in terms of in terms of PMDMC because one part of students make this mistake, they multiply it first, then divide, and we should go, we should find where do we have this multiplication and division sign. Let's look at it. So right here we have addition, right here we have division. Yeah, we need this, we need this division sign. Yeah, so we need this division sign right here in this expression, okay? So we need this expression right here, so we don't have multiplication sign, we have, we have division sign. But I want to go a little bit further, let's look at it. It. So we should divide it first, but I want to go a little bit further. So if you look close, the addition and subtraction, this is our last group, and we have this addition sign. So we, we have only addition sign and only division sign. So we don't have any subtraction sign. But if you look closely, we have division and addition sign. But parentheses have the highest priority and then exponent, multiplication, division and addition and subtraction. So addition and subtraction have the lowest priority, which is really important step. So every time division have the higher priority than division, which is really important moment. So multiplication division group is all the time before addition and subtraction. So we should start from division every time and doesn't matter. You will have maybe maybe multiplication right here, doesn't matter. Multiplication and division is all the time before addition and subtraction. So let's start from this division at first. So we have 50 plus 50 divided by 2 equal to 25. Okay, 25. And then the last step, then last step is 
is addition, which is really important. So last step is is addition. So 50 plus 25 equal to equal to 75. But if you look closely to our options, we don't have this option 75. And this is very tricky moment because then one part of students goes back to this answer 50 and they say, okay, let's solve this question randomly. That's we don't have this option 75. Let's go back to this wrong answer 50. 50 right now, I want to say that 50 is absolutely incorrect solution for us because we can't start with addition then division. This is very big and very huge mistake in terms of math. Of course, with parentheses, this question is okay because then we should start from this parentheses parentheses which, ha which have the highest priority so then we should start from these parentheses at first and this addition will be will have will have the highest priority than division because it's inside parentheses which is really important moment in our case we don't have any parentheses so we just we just skip this part we don't have this option a we don't have this 50 which is absolutely bad solution but let's look closely for example at this 150 over 2 it looks like a simple division which is equal to 75 which is really interesting moment because right now we can right that our correct answer our correct answer is option option c is a correct answer to this to this question and really interesting moment right now correct answer is c but a lot of students all this wrong and they say correct answer is is 50 and if you made this error i'm happy you made this because you won't make this again you'll be like okay now let's go ahead and apply the order of operations and now pretty easy stuff so here's our problem so anytime you're faced uh, you like with uh, with this numeric expression you'll get better at this through practice so uh, you won't be thinking to yourself okay let's go and let's apply this pmdmc order of operation but one really important moment now some of you out there like if you type this into like a basic calculator on your laptop some of those calculators you know are just going to do the problem as you type it in okay so if you plug in this question for example you can easily take right now your calculator and plug in this question into your calculator i give 90 percent that you will have answer 50 and you ask why okay i will explain you because then uh, your calculator works with problem as you type it in so if you type this 50 plus 50 and sometimes calculators gives you 100 instantly without any any continue right here they give you answer answer 100 instantly but if you want to solve this correctly you should use your something like uh, something sophisticated calculators like scientific or graphing calculator where you can just type type in the problem like this like this but whole problem not like 50 plus 50 then divided by 2 you type whole problem with parentheses with all signs that you have right here and then you will have your answer then 50 plus 50 divided by 2 then your calculators know that division is all the time before addition and uh, your calculator is smart enough to know order of operation but use uh, something sophisticated like scientific or graphing calculator which is really important okay this is our question this is our answer 75 option c i hope your answer is the same as mine but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong okay now if you need to learn basic math interesting brain test iq question right if you're struggling with basic math or like pre-algebra concept you can easily subscribe to my channel. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time. I hope you understand this explanation. But I want to say a little, a few words about um, about this or this order of operation. I solved this question according to PMDMC order of operation. And I want to say that there are a lot of uh, orders or orders of operation. For example, bot mass. This is um, maybe the same as PMDMC, but a little bit, a little bit differences in this order of operation, which is really important in our case because <clears throat> because we should know every order of operation. But in this case, doesn't matter what order of operation you select. Doesn't matter. PMDMC, bot mass. We will have the same answer because in every order of operation in the world, what or what, where you where you live, doesn't matter. Every time division is before addition this is like a, the most popular rule in math so every time division is is before addition which is really important and really interesting moment okay so i hope you understand my thought about it i hope you understand why 75 is a correct answer i hope you understand why 50 is incorrect answer this is my main goal on my channel so i hope you i hope you learn something new Okay, if you need to help with any of these classes, you can just go through my YouTube channel. I have a ton of videos. So with that being said, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time. Wishing you all the best. I hope you I hope you learned something new. This is a very interesting interesting challenge. Many students make this mistake. They they don't care about order of operation. They just want to divide. They just want to add at first. They have like completely incorrect solution. So we hope you learned something new. This is my main goal on my channel. I have a ton of videos. 
So with that being said, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time. Wishing you all the best and take care of yourself.